My name is Dari Farios, co-founder and CEO of Cryptpack.com. Cryptpack.com is your one-stop hub for all your home items and services in Nigeria. You can think of us as the eBay of home items and services in Nigeria. Back then in school, I had been into some things that gave me extra funds and I realized that entrepreneurship kind of gave you an experience to create what you have always imagined. I worked for a while, but I wasn't really gaining satisfaction. It was like a process. You are doing the same thing over and over again. And after doing it for like four years, I think I really got tired of it. But before leaving, I had already started working on Cryptpack. So it wasn't like I just left and had to start from scratch. In my own local environment, entrepreneurship is a bit frowned upon because it's a bit, it's more uncertain. Though entrepreneurship has always been uncertain, but it's like, it's far more uncertain than people. So even your parents or your loved ones will be quick to tell you, hey, do you really know what you're going <laughs> into? How are you going to survive? And you look at it and like, okay, but at a point in time, the thing keeps boiling in you to you like, okay, I think I just have to take this. Also funding. Uh, <laughs> While startups might be a very good idea, it may sound fun while you are with your fellow startup colleagues, immediately you leave that environment, you are meeting people who feel they have a better way of investing their money than investing in your startup. Take for instance Lagos, the property market works so well in Lagos, so an average investor, I know if I put my money in properties, I'll get my money back. But how am I sure if I put my money in you, <laughs> the money will be... <laughs> so you have to be able to convince the person that Beyond what you are getting to get in your properties in terms of investment, you are getting so going to get so much more from this. No matter how sweet the statistics might be, the facts, there are a lot of things you still don't know, even if you've been working in that environment. Go on ground, don't just send people around to go and do things for you. Go on ground, see what is happening exactly. Because especially in Nigeria, you don't really have that facts or stats that's locked up somewhere that you can pull it from and say, okay, this is what I can validate this start, it works and I'll go ahead with it. You have to go on ground to go and get the information yourself.